You're live with BBC News now. The latest in the search for the hunt for the missing British schoolgirl Madeleine McCann appears to have drawn to a close in Portugal. Briefing tents have been taken down and heavy machinery removed from the site at a reservoir in the Algarve. Officers spent three days searching the remote location after information about the case was given to German prosecutor Celeste Set Head. Live to the location, our correspondent Navtej Johal is there at the reservoir. And uh, Navtej, just take us through those latest developments. What is actually happening there today? Well, after three days of intensive searches, things appear to be very much winding down here. All of the attention of the police appears to have been focused on that peninsula over there on the western side of the Arade Reservoir. That's where all of the work has been taking place. The machinery being used, the equipment, the sniffer dogs, everything has been happening over there. And over the last couple of hours, we've seen everything coming down. White tents that were set up there have been coming down. Vehicles carrying all of the equipment, emergency divers, police officers, all have been removed and are being taken away. And if I move you over here, you might be able to see where the attention is focused at the moment because all of these cameras, all of these camera crews, reporters, vehicles are pointing up that road in that direction because there is an expectation that that roadblock may be coming down. That was set up by police at the start of the week, so nobody could access that road leading up to where the police have been searching. And at the moment, everybody appears to be waiting to see whether that roadblock may be taken down. But yes, very much it appears that this operation is now coming to an end. Even the base camp is now being dismantled. And is there any sort of indication of uh, whether the police found anything and, and what actually happens next? Well, the German state prosecutor, uh, who's been really leading this investigation, uh, he has been playing down any hope of an immediate, imminent breakthrough over the last day or so. It appears to be the case that although this uh, investigation began because of Christian Bruckner, the convicted German sex offender, who last year was named as an official suspect uh, into Madeleine McCann's disappearance, there doesn't appear to be, at the moment, as far as we are aware, a significant breakthrough on the horizon. Horizon. We're still awaiting, actually, even official confirmation from Portuguese police that this search is now going to come to an end. Now, Christian Bruckner has always denied having any involvement in Madeleine McCann's disappearance and has never been formally charged. But this search seems to have been prompted by police saying that they were aware that uh, Christian Bruckner spent a great deal of time visiting this area around the time that Madeleine McCann disappeared. So we are currently waiting to see whether, first of all, as we, as we can see in front of, in front of us and, and uh, what's happening over here, that this search is now coming to an end. And over the next day or so, we expect to hear from the German state prosecutor as to whether anything significant has been found. But over the course of today, it appears to be the case that they, they are playing down the hope of an imminent breakthrough. Natesh, we'll leave it there. Uh, thanks very much.